Dota 2 won't launch and throws you an error 127, followed by a standard advice to check local game files in Steam. And obviously, checking local game files doesn't help no matter how many times you try. This video is about a specific error which started to occur after Dota 2 update in January 2023 and it happens on Windows 7 systems. If your situation is different, this video might not help you. The error text basically says that there are some dependencies that the game tries to use but fails. And the reason for that is that Windows 7, being a 15-year-old operating system in 2023, lacks some of the new procedures that the updated Dota 2 client tries to use in 2023. The best solution to avoid this particular problem and many other problems in the future is perform a clean install of at least Windows 10 on your computer. You can make a dual boot system to still keep Windows 7 for other tasks, but you will have to use Windows 10 or 11 or later to play Dota 2 or maybe switch to Linux, where Dota 2 runs natively. The good news for Windows 7 aficionados is that an update for Windows 7 exists and it will resolve this issue if you install it on your Windows 7 machine. So you can still play Dota 2 without the need to switch to a modern operating system. The Windows update in question is KB4474419. I personally tried to install this update on a Windows 7 system which failed to run the updated version of Dota 2 in early 2023 and it did help to resolve the issue. So in most cases you only have to download this update, you will find the direct link to the Microsoft website to download it in the description below, install it, reboot the system, wait while the update applies, and then just run Dota 2 and it will work. However, in some rare cases, especially if you are using a non-legit copy of Windows activated with some obscure methods, this update may lead to your Windows becoming unbootable. In any case, it is advisable before doing anything to make a backup of your important files to an external drive and create a Windows restore point before making any changes to your system. In this case, if an update goes wrong, you will have the opportunity to revert everything back and to uninstall this update and boot into your system. And if you are not sure about your Windows copy, you may want to install another update, which is KB3080. 1149. Make a system restore point, install this update first, reboot your system, try to launch Dota 2. If it works, that's okay. If it doesn't, then install the other update which I mentioned earlier. In any case, it is safe to install both updates one after another. And this should resolve your issue and Dota 2 will still run on Windows 7 systems in 2023. You will find the official links to the updates on the Microsoft website in the description below. I am the god of YouTube. Like, subscribe, thanks, jingle bells.